Hello everybody, I am back from Spawn War Overlords and I am going to be bringing you another custom match and this is called Star Jeweled, it is kind of like Bejeweled if anybody has ever played that and I am just terrible at it. This is my screen, um, I just have this little replay timer over there just so... Yeah, it's just kind of there just because I couldn't do it during the game or else it would just be... I couldn't talk and concentrate on that at the same time. I'm just really bad at any anyway. You can just see my really, really bad moves. Um, so this is pretty much a best of three game. It's kind of like it's like uh, Bejeweled. You gotta match them up and you get energy in which you buy units with to destroy your opponent. And I pretty much just got a whole bunch of zealots right there, saving up all my energy. It's definitely going to. Nope, they got a bunch of guys too. I did slow. Um, uh, somebody slowed them down. And you can see I'm really bad. I had to completely reset that almost right away. So there's all my zealots. It's just going to be destroying all the marines. The marines are free. Every match that you make, you get one marine. If you get like four in a row, then you get two marines. You have to get three in a row at least. Three, three in a row is the minimum. So you got to go to five games. You can't really see here because that little thing's in the way. But you got to get to five. Whoever gets three wins, wins. And this game, this these game modes can last an insanely long time. They can last, um, they can last an hour if both players are, if the, both all four players are really good. So it can just literally drag on. I do got some mutas there. Red has a siege tank, got a colossus, and he's pretty much just getting roaches and just getting more marines. I don't know what purple is doing. See, look how bad I am. Look how slow I am at this. Um, getting more. Zealots from um, Teal. I think I do get a Banshee. No, more Mutas. Mutas are really good in this game mode, actually. Uh, they're actually the least countered unit. Other than these, they don't give counters for some reason. But he actually has the least counters. He's only got two. <coughs> so they're really good against everything. You can see him just kind of destroy Marines in like one shot. And these four, you got four turrets protecting your base. As well as this thing, and the four turrets do count as your base life bar. Uh, does get he does get some immortals, does get some zealots. We do got some size storms, which are activated down here. There's size storm, 300 energy. Healing wave is 250. Time bomb is 200. Warp warp cell is 150, and that just resets this. I do get a whole bunch of zealots trying to counter everything he has. I'm pretty sure the immortals does not say, but I I knew. The counters are pretty much the same as in the actual game, so Zealots counter Immortals anyway. In the normal game, really good Psy Storm just went down, as you can see, just killed a whole bunch of Zealots. And there's a bunch of Marines here. Marines are not very strong, they're pretty weak, he wants to get to everything. And this t you can't select anything either, so. Uh, more guys are warping in, I'm almost at max energy. There we go, I did get something. Look at all these Zealots, more Zealots coming out. I do get five, no, four Mutas. And there goes the time bomb thing. It slows them all down, as you can see. And here comes the Mutas. They pretty much one-shot Zealots, so... You do not want to go Zealots against Mutas. Or else you're going to pretty much lose. And we pretty much just take this game very si easily, actually. Uh, we did not have much trouble with it. Uh, it's like a flawless victory. As we didn't even take any damage yet. So we're pretty good. We're pretty. We're we're holding them off really good. We're holding them off really well. Um, I do got more mutas. Mutas are awesome. As I just like getting more of them. More marines are being warped in, or whatever you want to call it. Uh, but they all die. This cannon's about to go down. Bunch of hydras, and hydras really good against mutas. So that's that's pretty much where the mutas end. And there they go. And you got to blow this up at the end after blowing up all the four cannons, and it's going to go down. There it goes. So we have just ran. So it's one zero right now out of five. Um, this game does not last actually too long. I did I did two rounds out of five, and it was actually longer than this entire best of five. Okay, but anyway, you can really see how bad I am. Look how many Marines Red has, and look how many Marines I have. I have three, and he keeps getting them. I'm just really bad. I kind of like purple on there. Look how many guys purple gets, and look how much teal gets. So I am pretty much like the weak link in this game or whatever you want to call it. I am like the guy who is no good. So it does get the time bomb and does Psy Storm and look at all these zealots just rushing in here. They're going to pretty much kill everything. 
Look at them just chopping up. Um, and look at them, they're pretty much killing so many things. Zealot's really strong. I do got the Mutas. Uh, Red did get a Banshee, which is actually really good of him to get the Banshee because they're also really strong against Zealots. Psy Storm's on there, going to kill all those Zealots. And a couple of Zealots over here. We're going to hold this off pretty good. Not losing too much health. Probably about a fifth. I got a Banshee as well and a couple of Zealots just because I had the extra resources or energy to get them. And this is the distance. The, the base distance between the two bases is not huge. These Zealots are just going to cut up those Marines. I did lose my Mutas. Um, ghosts are really good too, but uh, but not against their counselors. If you put them against any of those guys in red, you're pretty much screwed. So here comes the Colossus on the way right now. Going to be rosing up some Marines. Does you? I do use the little thing. It stops it from attacking for, I believe, 15 seconds. Yeah, 15 seconds. So it pretty much like immobilizes it. Uh, we should get a Stice from right here because that would just be really effective. And he's just pretty much going to be needling me. And I'm, I'm not even lo looking at this. If you're watching this... There's no point. I'm just so bad at this. It's it's like it's funny how terrible I am at be jeweled or star jeweled. I should get this four in a row. Do yeah, there we go. Got the four in a row. So I do get another banshee. I'm gonna watch this. Um, there's one match there. Um, there's a match there or a match there. Okay. There's a match there. There's a match there. You missed that. And yeah. So those guys are gonna be getting toasted away. There we go. Uh now once you go there, there we go. Good job. Fantastic. I'm uh, fantastic apparently. So here comes Amita showing up for uh purple and they do counter banshees because banshees do not attack the air. So I still don't really got a reason for that. Side storm's going down on the hydras, hydras should go down, one of them does go down. And he is just pretty much going to push into my base. So we are doing better. Um, you see the enemy is much lower on whatever the, the, their health bar. And I did get some ghosts. There's the ghost there. And if you watched it, look at mine. Look how slow mine's going and compared to my allies. Yeah. Yeah, I'm really slow at this game. Does use Sty Storm on all those marines. There we go. There's another one. There's another one right there. Still, still there actually. Here, oh, red got an ultra lisk. So I had to reset it again. I'm so bad. There's so it tells you if you have no removes, but I just didn't want to look spend time looking for moves. And I usually find more if I reset the board than if I look. Oh, you see the ultra lisk? He exploded pretty awesomely there. Um, this cannon should go down. Does kill Lemuda and Side Storms right on the spawning location. So, bunch of roaches that are showing up. We should get some air units. I do got a ghost there. I'm um, ready getting siege tanks, and we're pretty much going to do that time bomb. I don't. It does. I think it does delay shots. As there we go, 2-0, and so we're pretty much dominating. So we, they need three more wins, and we only need one more to get to claim victory over our opponents. Start. Okay, here we go. Pretty much entered. I have. Th he has 330, and I just have 90. Yeah, I'm so bad. It's it's really fun though. It's um really fun. It it's can actually it's be it's better than other games because other games it's just a time limit. And this one you're actually trying to completely destroy and kill hundreds of people by putting a pu putting puzzle pieces or whatever you want to call them together. Just smashing symbols and you're killing people with those symbols. I did get some roaches, just wanted to test them out. Um, roaches are pretty much countered by air, which I don't know why they go. So, once again, we're pretty much going to be pushing in really heavily there. I am st um, stocking up all my energy. Oh wait, I, oh, wait, that's our total energy we've ever consumed. Okay. Okay, there. There's a four in a row. That's always nice to get. There's none there. No, it, apparently it's not there anymore because I moved that. One there. Um, pink, uh, purple did get a Colossus and did get a Banshee. And Marines just suck at this. They suck at trying to kill things, so don't ever try to rely on just the Marines. I never get too, if you're playing, don't get too wrapped up in this. Don't just keep looking at this and completely forget about these. 
or else you will lose so quickly. So we gotta hold our base. We haven't been attacked yet. Psy storming up. We do got four Banshees, which is actually just gonna really push right into their base. There we go. Just taking out Marines. No problem. Able to hold that off. We didn't even take any damage there. And it does slow down time. And all the Banshees do go down, but they were able to defend us, so that was pretty good. Uh, we do got one there. Or we had a different one, I guess. One there. One's there. But if we get this one, that one drops on there. Oh no, four in a row. Nice. That was actually a fail. Misclick. Wrong move. There was a four in a row. I'm just really bad. I, I always hate it when you get like, and then you know through the four, and then you, you completely mess it up. So Zealot's going to be chopped off. Oh no, we've been attacked. We've been attacked. That's no fun. This thing just keeps yelling, good job in my ear. And fantastic. I don't know how many. I don't know if it says fantastic often. Because I'm not fantastic at this at all. So the Colossus is going to go down. A couple more Hydras are showing up. And they're pretty much just killing that. You pretty much just pretty much just watch this. Don't watch this. Watch this. Don't watch this. This is bad. I'm, not, I'm going to put my allies on there. Just so you can watch his. Because it's a little more entertaining. It's kind of cool how you can see these. Good. So he gets good jobs. Okay, but anyway, he does stasis this ultralist. So he just um, put the little stasis field. I th is it called stasis field? No, it's warp cell. I was way off on that. Whatever. I don't think stasis is anything even on this. <laughs> so I don't know where I was thinking stasis from. But um, looks like they are going to try to make an offensive push. Uh, we do use psi storms. Um, ultralist is going to kind of destroy everything, except it dies right there. Hand falls over. It looks like it crushed a marine, but whatever. And it, they decompose very, very fast. Very, very fast. So, do we got anything over here? There's a three there. Uh, we do got a three there, and we do got a couple of more side storms. A couple of hydras, a couple of zealots gonna show up there, and they're trying to get over their speed warp cell. Another side storm going down. This could go either way right now. It looks like they're actually winning right now. Going to be trying to make a big push. Um, I don't know if Red's been stockpiling energy. Well, not much. But he just spent it on something. I got four more. I've got four ghosts. I try to see them. They're really good against infantry. But when you size them, they all die. See, look, all three of them die at once, and I could just get sniped. Yeah, so if you have a lot of ghosts, you better hope they don't go with an energy uh, Psy Storm because they'll just completely destroy you. Or Psionic Storm, but who calls them Psionic Storm? They're really. So here they are, going to be pushing in. Lightning, Psionic Storm right there, going to be killing a bunch of guys. A uh, bunch of Zealots, a couple of Hydras showing up. Uh, we got the tanks here. Zealots going to be trying to rip through my, my army. My army's pathetic, so not very hard to rip through that. Tank going to go down. They are going to make another push. Defending against that really well. Making some very, I know, awesome brick movements. Yeah. This is so exciting. It, all of this is happening because of this. So. Ooh. Look at all these kills. We've had like 500 kills. So We've had almost six, maybe even 700 kills in this lone match in this one little in the th third game so here we go side storm going across these siege tanks uh, and i think we are going to make another push against this and there we go a couple of zealots showing up i don't think teal has anything right now i think i do get more mutas this muta is really good we haven't even nobody's even lost a cannon yet so if that says anything. How about a whole bunch of zealots are showing up to kill everybody, but we do got um I got hardcore. Take that everybody. But I do got some mutas. I red got two ultras and a colossus. Uh, I think one of those are actually my No, one of them isn't, I don't think so. There's reds and he's just gonna be going to try to kill one of these turrets. Yeah, no, they're all reds. I got my there's my ultra list. Um, so one cannon does go down. 
on. They do got a bunch on their hands. They got what three ultras and a colossus in their base, as well as siege tanks, with a bunch of marines and I believe mutas. Yes. So they're gonna have a hard time defending against this. Here comes the muta out of their station field. And that's Stasis. Oh, look at the Ultra. He got disintegrated. How often do you even see that? And here they come. They're going to try to kill everything. We should see some psionic storms. There we go. The Psy storm's going down, killing a whole bunch of Marines. But what he wants to kill is the Ultra List. For some reason, you need to kill the turret first before you can blow up the building. All their cannons go down. And we pretty much won that. We, we cleaned that up. So, there we go. Victory was achieved by us. There's the little end screen. Just say all the people leaving. So the opponents leave, then our ally leaves. And then the game ends when I leave. So let's look at this. Um I cleared one one that I cleared the least oh no! Raptor did worse than me. Raptor did worse than me. I had to use four resets, but Raptor had to use nine. I never wasted any energy. Yeah. All my energy was used fairly. And nicely, too. And Mutas were my favorite unit. Uh, my ally had Sea Shanks as his favorite. I summoned 131 units. So, yeah. I didn't. Sp actually, I didn't cast any spells that game. Hmm. Okay. But anyway, I also wanted to say one thing. Every single new map that is featured in custom games I'm gonna bring all those to you just so you can see what's um I don't know what do you call them popular whatever you want to call it hot popular popular custom games and I'll be bringing you all of those when they are released whatever they are I don't care if they are solitaire the Starcraft edition so I'll be gonna bring it to you okay this has been Spawn Overlords thanks for watching remember to check out um my more cast coming up okay and bye